Welcome to Truckin' Tuesday by Race Crews. Here we have a brand new item from Hot Wheels. It's Pencil Pusher. Comes with a school bus. Check out the truck. Nice, bright colors. Here you have some math symbols. On the back, it tells us what the features are. Detachable cab. That means you can take the cab off of the trailer. Check it out. The trailer roof is a ruler, and you can use the hole to sharpen crayons. There's the sharpening tool. Our school bus is sitting on top of the ruler. Maybe you have that school bus. Its name is actually Hot Wheels High. Maybe you got this shiny gold release in 2016. There was actually two releases in 2016. You could have got silver or gold. This year, 2017, there's a blue release. Maybe you found this one. The very first release was this one here. Hot Wheels High. It was introduced in 2013. This was the very first release. As a matter of fact, I used it for track time. Let me share that with you now. Up next, new for 2013, brand new model. We got the next uh, Hot Wheels bus, Hot Wheels High. It's interesting, it says uh, great for the track right here on the corner. Great for the track. Got a plastic body. Metal base. <coughs> I guess we should put it this way, it'd be a little better. Hey, Mark. Gets it. Hey, slow, you're a bus. You're supposed to be with kids. Slow, slow down. Hey, they're telling the truth. Great for the track. I thought the lot slowing down. Come on. Ooh. A little more gas. Oh. oh. So if you're a fan of Hot Wheels High, so far there are four models to collect. I also did track time with one of these two. I'll show you that one later in the video. Let's go ahead and open this up. I like the features that they include with the truck. You can see the math symbols right there. Not only that, the pencil sharpener, if you've seen pencil sharpeners, it'll usually have a container to catch your shavings. Well, that's how they made this part right here. It makes it look like a pencil sharpener, but the front's not a pencil sharpener. It actually has a little spot for you to put things. It's kind of small, barely holds this much of my finger. Here's the ruler. Let's go ahead and check out the trailer. Let's see if uh, Hot Wheels High can fit in the back. Looks like, looks like he'll fit. Let's go ahead and open it up. Very neat. It's got like a, it's got like, oops, oops. It has like ridges. Let's go ahead and take out, well, first, let's put in the bus. We said we're gonna put in the bus. Let's drive him in. Uh oh. His roof, his front part hits that. Let's give him a little bit of a help, lift him up, push him in. There you go. Oh, I put this on backwards. There you go. I see you. Let's take out the ruler. Oh, when you close this, the ruler doesn't come out. Oh, that's good, so this way you won't lose it. Now you can take out the ruler and you can do some drawing. Hey, now you got a sunroof, or you're a convertible. It really is a ruler. On one side, you can see it says inch. So it's one inch, two inch, three inch. Measures four inches and a half. Or you can look at the other side. It has centimeters for people who use the metric system. And that goes all the way up to 11, just over 11 centimeters. It has a sharpener for crayons, so I bought some crayons to check it out. Look at my paper. It has dots along the sides of the paper. <laughs> that tells you how old the paper is. It's really old. You ever see paper with dots on the side? Let's see. Let's go ahead and draw something. How about we write my channel name? Race. Race. 
screws. And we need the track too. We gotta have to draw some track for race screws. Let me wear down this crayon because I wanna see how well the sharpener works. So let's use some of the crayon. Wear it down. Because you're going to want to test it too, right? You're curious how well it's going to sharpen crayons as well. Let's see. Oh, I didn't make it too flat. But yeah, you can see it's used up a little bit. Now let's try it out. Let's turn it this way. That's where the shavings will come out. Doesn't look like it has any sharp spots. But let's try it out. Hey, there you go. Look, it's it's making a point, helping me make a point again. Let me take off some of the paper. Let's try it some more. See if we can get a point on there. Well, if I kept going. I could shave it down to a point, but I don't want to go keep going because then basically you're shaving off this part of the crayon, which still has some use. How about the stencil that allows you to draw circles? I should have used the circles for race screws. I got two circles right there. Let's try that again. Let's use some colors this time. Race R A C, E, so hard to see yellow, huh? They call it goldenrod or amarillo. R A C E, G, R, now let me do it O, O, I need another O. V E S. Race screws. Let's see. Now let's try that thing. Remember, it said that you can store your crayons. <laughs> it's gonna be, it's gonna be kind of hard to use it to store your crayons, because they're a lot taller. And how many can we fit in there? Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Got six. I don't know about seven. Excuse me. Excuse me. Can I come in? No. Looks like six. But you know what? This is a pretty good area too. I like this. There's six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, I think ten. Do you remember that I said I had one more Hot Wheels high that I used for track time? Let me show you that now. In the meantime, have fun with your toys and happy collecting. Bye bye. Let's try Hot Wheels high. Wheels high, nice and shiny. Let's see if he can knock the Jaguar off the track. Boom! Nope, Jaguar's still there. Maybe Winning Formula can get underneath him and throw him off the track. Boom! Right into the air. All right, let's clear the track and let's see if the bus can make it all the way. Uh-oh, low bridge. Time for a little bit of adjusting. And go! Let's see if he can get a lap. Coming around, one. And he's coming around, 
Two. You got two laps. The bus got two laps. Three. Oh, he finished three laps. I think he's done the best so far. <laughs>